Valdosta State University students are moving into residence halls for the fall semester. Classes begin Monday. WAOV News 10's Mackenzie Petrie focuses on the school's culture that keeps families coming back. It is very important to us to keep the legacy up here at VSU because my other two children, they were afforded an excellent education and they're doing great things. Valdosta State University is down two residence halls to house students. However, Dr. Vince Miller says the university still has availability for incoming and interested students. It was real important for me because number one, comfortability, like just being around the area for a couple of years, finding out how the people are and how the area is. It was just real comfortable for me. Tracy Kincaid and her husband helped move in their third son, Hunter Kincaid, who will be returning to Valdosta State University for his second fall semester. We are actually about 90% occupied for fall, which is great. And we're still moving students in. We always have students that will show up at the last minute that are interested in Valdosta State and want to live on campus. And we welcome them in and, and are excited to have them. But One reason VSU creates family legacies is because parents say the school communicates well. I love the staff here. Everybody is so accommodating and um, it just warms my heart. Even though our son is three hours, almost three and a half hours away, it warms my heart to know that I could call at any time and get the answers that I need. An example of family focus here at VSU is a program they recently started called Fresh Check Day. It's a day where students can get help and support on their emotional struggles. Mackenzie Petrie, WALB, your hometown news source.